Hey, welcome back to Cool Gets Art and let's draw the Spider-Man from Avengers Infinity Wars. So let's get started with a quick sketch and then I will show you line by line on how you can draw this. Alright, so let's draw this and to begin we're going to draw his head shape first which is probably the, uh, the hardest part. And so just try to draw like an egg shape but like slightly, a little bit sharper on the bottom. Okay, so we're just going to go around. And this is a very tricky shape to draw, especially freehand. So you can sketch it out with pencil first. So just try to get an egg shape like this, a little bit sharper on the bottom. Okay, and then from here, just kind of make two dots. Like if this is center, just kind of come down a little bit, make two dots on, the, on each side. And then from here, we just kind of go up. Okay, so it's... I know it's a little bit of an odd shape, but just kind of come all up and then just kind of curve it into the side. And then from here, we're going to come back down. Okay, and then we're going to curve it back to that point. So same thing here, we can start here. Just curve it down and then we're going to connect this. And once we have that, we can draw the inner detail so this one is just going to be a little bit easier all we're doing is just kind of follow that shape that we drawn already and just give it a little bit of thickness all right so that's pretty much the head and we'll draw in the webbings later so let's move on to the body so right here just draw two lines for his neck and then we're going to come out straight out I'll give him wide shoulders all right and then once we have this we have to draw the chest area here so just kind of come down at this angle just draw a little curve from here and then once we have this we're going to draw in the rest of the body so we're just going to continue as if there's a line here just kind of pinch it in this is going to be his waist so again we're going to imagine there's a line and just kind of curve it in all right, and then we're gonna close it off with this curve. This is part of his uniform. So that's gonna be his waist. All right, so let's move on and we'll draw in the, the, the details later, but let's, let's get in one of his arms first. So from here, just gonna curve it out. It's gonna be his shoulders. And right here, just draw a little line like this. So we're gonna make him muscular. So from here, this is gonna be his bicep. We're gonna come out and this is gonna be his little elbow right there. Elbow on the back. And then we're gonna flare it out and then close it because there's gonna be some details right there. And then we're gonna continue this and just kind of go down. Just curve it out and this is gonna be his arm. And then close that off. So that's gonna be his wrist. Okay, and then to draw him uh, his fist is gonna be a little bit easier, so we're just gonna come out. On the back, just kind of come out and then just curve it back in. It's gonna be his fisk. Okay, so let's move on to the other arm and again, we'll put in the uh, details later. So we're gonna come out on the shoulder, same thing as the other side. And we're gonna give a little line here again. So again, we're gonna come out a little bit and then we're going to close it off kind of make it flat because his hand's going to be in a different position and then from here we're going to come out to draw his arm so flare it out and then pinch it in and then close it off okay so that, now we're going to draw his hand and I'm going to have him do his web shooter thing so this is going to be his thumb and we can draw in his little palm on the on the underside first and now we can draw in one finger okay and then here we're going to draw his pinky a little, a little bit shorter and then in the middle we just draw in his two fingers here it's going to be folded in okay so that's the easy way of drawing it so now let's see let's draw in his legs before we move on to his to details so on his legs on, in the middle right here just kind of come down and make a little line right there. 
And now we can draw in his legs. So we're gonna go out and just come back in and this is gonna be his knee. So let's draw in the other side first. So the same shape as that one and we're stopping at the knee. Okay, and then we're gonna continue on for the knee, just kind of give a little bit of curve there, not, not too much. And then now for his lower leg, gonna come out. Okay, we're gonna stop there, just drawing a line. That's for the detail on his socks. So we're gonna come down, now we're gonna pinch it in. Okay, and then his heel. And then now for his foot, just come out and we'll Keep it simple, and then just close that off. So let's draw the other side, so kind of same thing, a little bit straight. Curve it out. Close it off. Come down. This heel. Come out again and then close it off. All right, so that's pretty much his body. So let's move in and draw the awesome uh, spider logo in, in, uh, on his chest. So right in the middle here, like, right where you draw the chest, right above here, just draw a little angle. Okay, and then from here, we're gonna come down. And now we're gonna come out again, come down, Okay, and then we're gonna pinch it in to the middle again. So we're drawing that shape. And then now for the, the spider legs, so just try to follow, just go slant, straight up, slant, okay? So same thing on this side, slant, straight up, slant. Okay, and then we gotta draw the same thing here, so it's the same thing, we just, we can actually start from the top, and slant it in, here, slant, straight, slant it in. And then now for this one, we're gonna continue this one, go out, we're just following this outside curb here, this other curb, gonna come straight down. So out, come straight down, and then we're just gonna come up and just connect that to that, to a little spider there. Okay, I know it's a little bit tricky, but just kind of take it uh, step by step, right? So now for this one, we're gonna come out, slant, it's kind of a weird angle, okay? And then here we're gonna start, slant, it's the same thing. And then for this one, we just kind of curve it out a little bit more. All right, so then on this side, we're gonna continue this line a little bit, slant up, Go out toward the shoulder, and then again from here, we're gonna come out, slant, and then just kind of curve it a little bit out more. So now from here, we just draw in, we're gonna come down, just kind of hook it. And then on this side, I think I drew it a little bit too tight, so I'll just come down, and if you have space, just kind of hook it just, just like the other one. And then right here, on this point here, just continue down. Just close that off. And that's pretty much it for the spider in the middle. So let's see on his uh, arm here, it's gonna be some detail. So we just draw that line. One more over here. So we're just giving uh, these lines some thickness. One over here and another one over here. Okay, and then we gotta draw, let's see. We need to draw a line here because it's gonna be a different material. So just kind of come across this arm. So these are easy, right? Because we already have the arm. All we're doing is just adding some extra lines. Okay. Then let's see. And then for his socks, same thing. Uh, just give this one some thickness. And then on the bottom here, it's kind of same thing. Just draw another line. So one line here, one more. 
All right, so now um, for the spider webbing, I'm gonna change my Sharpie so that that's, it's not too thick because or else it's gonna get really messy. So I'm gonna switch to a little thinner Sharpie, okay? So you can just draw lighter with a pencil or if you want. So right here in the middle, just draw a little circle right in between the eyes. And then we're gonna go straight up. It's gonna be one. And then on the side here, we're gonna draw another one. So one. And on both sides, just go out. Okay, and then on this one, just gonna come down. I'm just gonna give it a little bit of curve so that it's not so flat. And then one more here. All right. So then now for the webbing, we just go inward. So one, two, and then we're gonna go from this side. Just connect that. Doesn't have to be perfect as long as you have some kind of webbing moving around and it'll look good, right? Here, here, then here. So just curve it in. And then let's draw one more up here. Just go out somewhere. Probably is another line there. Okay, so whatever you can do, just kind of drawing those spaces. Okay, and then on the bottom here, we're gonna come to see, just kind of draw one center line and continue the center line. And then I'm gonna draw one line here. Okay, and then maybe one back here, a little bit tighter. So now I'm just gonna connect these lines. Just draw a little bit of webbing. Maybe another one here. So down here, I'll just draw it this way. It looks like it's a different kind of pattern. All right, and then let's see, let's draw some lines here. We're continuing. So continuing this, maybe one over here. All right, and then let's see. And then on the side here, we'll just draw in some lines, one, two, three. And then let's continue this one. We'll draw another line through that. We'll draw a couple of lines this way. And then on his hand, uh, we'll, just, we'll just draw in some lines like this. Keep it simple. All right, on the other side, so same thing, we'll continue this thing. Draw some lines in here. And maybe just a couple of lines in here. And I think his fingers goes around like this, right? So you can draw this on his finger, just cut it up a little bit. All right, so let's move on to the bottom. And it's pretty much the same thing. Uh, we can draw in, just draw in a couple of lines, trying to follow out the uh, shape of the foot here. Okay, just draw a line like that. And then what we do, just cut it up a little bit. And then on the foot here, just kind of curve it. Just curve it that way. So that's the key to make it look like it's three dimensional. Okay, and then we can just kind of curve it. And that is it for this new Spider-Man in the Avengers Infinity Wars. Hope you guys like the way it turned out. And if you do, please check out my other videos. Give me a thumbs up and I will see you next time.